all right what is going on guys willis gaming here we're back with another borderlands 3 video so we've got a pretty meaty video for you guys today we're going to be going over the new dlc coming in borderlands next month um the major i guess paid dlc and we're also going to be talking a bit about the takedown at malawan black site which is coming super super soon so the borderlands show basically gave us a bunch of information um i'm actually doing this video a day in advance so big shout out to 2k for providing the trailer and all the information for me but yeah if you guys enjoy the video be sure to leave a like down below i'm also running a giveaway this month guys for the death stranding collected edition if you would like to enter that just leave a like on the video leave a comment and uh, go down in the video description at the top you can enter through the link and i guess other than that if you'd like to get any cheap games be sure to head over to g2a.com and use my code willis gaming um, but yeah they just announced the first major dlc for borderlands 3 the actual i guess main dlc the uh, Malawan DLC is kind of like the, the free little mini raid, which I'll explain at the end of the video. But yeah, Moxie's heist of the handsome jackpot. And it's coming on December 19th, so next month. So pretty much in short, Moxie is recruiting you to seize control of a derelict space station built by the infamous Handsome Jack back when he was still president of the Hyperion Corporation. So it says the handsome jackpot is quite possibly the gaudiest gambling spot in the galaxy with neon signs, slot machines and gold statues all over the place. It's also crawling with multiple models of deadly Hyperion loader bots as well as lunatic looters who've been trapped on board ever since Jack's death. But that's not all. So here's all the stuff we can get to do in this, I guess, derelict space uh, casino so we can explore a glitzy new galaxy destination packed with unique zones worthy of handsome jacks lavish lifestyle and dirty dealings so we get to join moxie's crew of eccentric characters and pull off the ultimate casino heist in a series of thrilling campaign missions so i think with this comes a pretty much a brand new campaign which is awesome you get to discover hidden secrets and strange happenings in the handsome jackpot via a fresh side missions and crew challenges get a blast from pandora's past when you battle with the hyperion forces that outlived handsome jack including the never before seen enemies and larger than life bosses Perfect for your Vault Hunters gear loadout with all new legendary weapons and gear. Expand your collection of cosmetics with even more customization items, including Vault Hunter heads, skins, weapon trinkets, Echo Skins device, and new emotes. So to pretty much play this, Moxie's heist of the Handsome Jackpot is tuned for characters who are at least level 13. It will automatically scale up to higher level Vault Hunters so they can find a challenge and I guess appropriate level loot. So in order to access this content, you'll need to have unlocked Sanctuary 3, pretty much the massive spaceship, which you pretty much get by finishing the prologue for the campaign. And yeah, that's pretty much it. The trailer itself looks pretty intense. There's a lot going on. It looks like a planet in itself. I know it's kind of like a mini derelict spacecraft, but I'm assuming this will have a planet sized map to uh, explore and obviously have a bunch of sections. I'm going to think of it more like Promethea in like the size of this place where it's probably going to have like multiple sections for us to go to maybe like underneath and then on top and stuff and it's obviously going to have a lot of bosses and missions for the story but yeah they were also talking a bit about the Malawan Black Site the actual DLC which is coming in a few days actually so the takedown at Malawan Black Site is a brand new raid style challenge tuned for coordinated co-op parties of four max level characters with restricted spawning to make your opposition that much deadlier the all new mayhem 4 puts a spin on mayhem mode by removing all player penalties and instead of applying just two random modifiers one that applies a bonus to players and one that applies a bonus to enemies it also offers its own exclusive batch of legendary gear that will only drop while mayhem 4 is enabled so as discussed on today's episode on the live stream the patch also brings the following changes so this is throughout the whole game all bosses will now have dedicated loot pools so you can farm more efficiently for coveted legendary items maximum bank space will be upgraded from 50 to 300 slots as usual the sdus that boost your bank size can be purchased from marcus aboard sanctuary 3. a target dummy wearing a very familiar mask will be installed in sanctuary 3's shooting range so you can safely test out your new weapons new vending machines will be deployed across multiple maps players will now notice a overall ui performance um, and improvements so that's awesome so mayhem 4 will be coming that's pretty insane we also get our own batch of new legendary gear to chase 
So finally, Gearbox announced Mayhem 2.0, a long-term plan to overhaul Mayhem mode with more UI support and new Mayhem modifiers that change gameplay more dramatically, Mayhem playlists, new rewards, and additional levels of Mayhem to work through. More information about Mayhem 2.0 will be available next year, apparently. But for now, we're just going to have Mayhem 4, so that's going to be pretty intense. I'm super excited to jump into this Malawan Black Site mini raid. Be sure to jump in the Discord, discord.gg slash Willis, if you're looking to form a group, anything like that but yeah moxie's heist of the handsome jackpot is coming at december 19th if you don't have borderlands yet and you'd like to try it out you can play borderlands for free from november 21st to the 24th for free on xbox and playstation so if you want to try the game that's your time to play um hope you guys enjoyed be sure to subscribe if you're new and remember if you'd like to enter that death stranding collector's edition giveaway there'll be a link in the video description um yeah i'll see you guys in my next video this has been wallace gaming and peace